we are cruising Ha Long Bay right now, one of, a world famous site in northeast Vietnam. It is absolutely beautiful. Um, it's Ha Long Bay is the beautiful waters filled with these karst limestone mountains that jut out, and it really has a dreamlike, mysterious feel to it. And it's a very popular site, and it's absolutely beautiful. We opted for a superior cruise that was three days and two nights. Which means, of course, it's superior to all boats except the deluxe, the super deluxe, the very expensive luxury boat. So what superior really means is a mid-range boat. Um, typically, a uh, cruise like that, you have one day on the boat. So you're um, cruising Ha Long Bay, you're swimming, you're kayaking, you're visiting a cave in the area, and then the second day is spent on a local island, Kat Ba Island, where uh, we went bike riding, we visited a cave that was used as a hospital during the Vietnam War, and then really it's just free time. Go to the beach, swim, relax. In retrospect, if I could redo the tour, I would have spent both days on the boat, both days on Ha Long Bay. It's just so beautiful. The scenery is amazing. The sunset we saw was the, the best we've seen yet in our travels. And it's just fun to sit on the sun deck, to take in the scenery, to go for a swim, to go kayaking. So yeah, that was really fantastic. If I could, I'd do two days on the boat. Typically, I get motion sick. I mean, I could just look at the water and get sick. So I was prepared, had medicine, motion patch, motion pills ready for it. But I have to say, the waters here are so <coughs> tranquil, so serene. I don't think it would be a big problem for anyone. And with my medicine, I was perfectly fine. I have to say, I think this is the most enjoyable boat trip I've ever been on. As part of our Kat Ba Island day, we went for a bike ride. You know, it just wasn't my favorite part. We, it started out nice with nice views of the ocean, um, but our destination was kind of a dirty beach. The waters are blue and pristine. <sighs> the beach itself is covered with litter. <sighs> the beach is great if you just don't actually look at the sand. It needed a little, a little work. And then the return journey was just uphill. Lava, hot, sweaty. That's how it felt. <laughs> so that was more more work than I really wanted. Uh, so yeah, the bike ride wasn't wasn't quite as nice as I had hoped it would be. Surprisingly, there was a lot of negativity about the tours to Ha Long Bay because it is so popular. There's so many tourist boats, and everybody said it's just too crowded, which takes away from the beauty. So I was a little nervous when we got here. I have to say, I thought it was perfectly fine. It was wonderful. I, I didn't mind the other tourist boats in the water. Why wouldn't they be here? It's beautiful. Everybody wants to see it when you come to Vietnam. So I don't think that it ruins the experience at all. Yeah, there really are a lot of tourist boats. But guess what? Ha Long Bay itself is really large. So as you go out into the bay, it doesn't feel like there are a lot of boats. Ha Long Bay, thumbs up. Absolutely make it part of your trip. I think it's just beautiful. I, I just can't see coming to Vietnam and not coming here. <laughs>